I want to present to you a slideshow, Do You Know Your Cultural Art? In the following slides, can you identify the cultural art? Let's begin. Here we have a famous painting. This is American Gothic, it is a 1930 painting by Grant Wood in the collection of the Art Institute in Chicago. The painting is named for the house's architectural style. Here we have Fred Astaire, who was an American dancer, singer, actor, choreographer, and television presenter. He is widely considered the most influential dancer in the history of film. His stage and subsequent film and television careers span a total of 76 years. Johann Sebastian Bach was a German composer and musician of the Baroque period. He is known for instrumental compositions such as the Brandenburg Concertos and the Goldberg Variations, and for vocal music such as St. Matthew's Passion and the Mass in B minor. William James Count Basie was an American jazz pianist, organist, band leader, and composer. In 1935, Basie formed his own jazz orchestra, the Count Basie Orchestra. In 1936, took them to Chicago for a long engagement and their first recording. Ludwig van Beethoven was a German composer and pianist whose music ranks among the most performed of the classical music repertoire. He remained one of the most admired composers in the history of Western music. His work spans the transition from classical period to the Romantic area in classical music. Irving Berlin was an American poser and lyricist, widely considered one of the greatest songwriters in American history. His music forms the great part of the Great American Songbook. Born in Imperial Russia, Berlin arrived in the United States at the age of five. Jack Benny was an American entertainer who transitioned from modest success playing violin on the vaudeville circuit to a highly popular comedic career in radio, television, and film. The Birth of Venus is a painting by an Italian artist, Sandro Bocelli, probably made in the mid-1480s. It depicts the goddess of Venus arriving on the shores after her birth. Humphrey DeVoris Bogart was an American film and stage actor. His performance in classical Hollywood cinema films made him an American cultural icon. In 1999, the American Inst Film Institute selected Bogart as the greatest male artist of classic American cinema. The Brooklyn Bridge is a hybrid cable stayed suspension bridge in New York City spanning the East River between the boroughs of Manhattan and Brooklyn. Opened on May 24, 1883, the Brooklyn Bridge was the first fixed crossing of the East River. Archibald Archie Bunker is a fictional character from the 1970s American television sitcom, All in the Family, and its spin-off Archie Bunker's Place, played by Carol O'Connor. Bunker, uh, main character of the series, is a World War II veteran, blue-collar worker, and family man.
This iconic building, often called the Capitol Building, is a meeting place of the United States Congress and the seat of the legislative branch of the U.S. federal government. Located on Capitol Hill at the eastern end of the National Mall in Washington, D.C. Carnegie Hall is a concert venue in Midtown Manhattan in New York City. It is located at 881 7th Avenue, occupying the east side of East of 7th Avenue. It opened April 1891, 129 years ago. A cathedral is a church that contains the cathedra or the church de chair of a bishop, thus serving as a central church for a diocese, conference, or episcopate. Sir Charles Spencer Chaplin was an English comic actor, filmmaker, and composer who rose to fame in the era of silent film. He became a worldwide icon through his screen persona, The Tramp, and is considered one of the most important figures in the history of film industry. The Chartres Cathedral is also known as the Cathedral of Our Lady of Chartres, is a Roman Catholic church in Chartres, France, about 80 kilometers southwest of Paris, and is the seat of the Bishop of Chartres. The Colosseum of Rome is an oval amphitheater in the center of the city of Rome, Italy, just east of the Roman Forum, and is the largest ancient amphitheater ever built. Harry Villas Bing Cosby Jr. was an American singer, comedian, and actor. His first multi, the first multi-star, Cosby, was a leader in record sales, radio ratings, and motion picture, grossing from 1930 to 1954. He made over 70 feature films and recorded over more than 1,600 different songs. Walt Elias Disney was an American businessman, animator, writer, voice actor, and film producer. A pioneer in the American animation industry, he introduced several developments in the production of cartoons. This painting, The Persistence of Memory, is a 1931 painting by artist Salvador Dali and is one of the most recognizable works of surrealism. Albrecht Dürer is a German painter, printmaker, and theorist of Germany. He was born in Nuremberg reputation and influence across Europe spread when he was in his 20s due to his highly high quality wood cut prints. Bob Dylan is an American songwriter, author, and visual artist. 
Widely regarded as one of the greatest songwriters of all time, Dylan has been a major figure in popular culture for more than 50 years. The Empire State Building is a 102-story Art Deco skyscraper in the midtown Manhattan, New York City. It was named, derived from the Empire State, the nickname of the state of New York. The Gargoyle is an architecture, a specifically Gothic architecture. A gargoyle is carved or form grotesque design or the spout design to convey water from a roof away from the side of the building. And this ends, do you know your cultural art? I hope you were be able to identify some of the art icons. If not, I hope you learned something. So thank you very much for watching.